Hello, my name is Jasmine Johnson, and I'll be performing a Foley catheter insertion in a male patient. First thing I would do is to review my order. I would check for any allergies to latex or iodine, and I would collect my supplies. At this point, I would perform hand hygiene. Then I would identify my patient by their two identifiers. I would provide for privacy and explain the procedure to the patient. I would also provide for good lighting. I would put my trash can in reach, and then I would adjust the bed to a comfortable working level. I would also make sure that my client is positioned on his back, and then I would drape just the area that I'm going to be working on. And I would separate his legs slightly. At this time, I would wash my hands and then put on clean gloves. And then I would clean the perineum. And then I will remove my gloves and perform hand hygiene. At this point, I can set up my sterile field. I will open up my supplies away from me. I will take my blue drape, putting the shiny side down between the patient's legs, and then I can put on my sterile gloves. The first glove I will only touch on the inside. The second glove I will touch on the outside. And then I will discard my glove package in the regular trash can. At this point, I can move my catheter supplies onto the blue drape. And I will take off the cap to my syringe. I will also attach my water syringe to the balloon port on the cap. And I will remove the plastic wrapping from the catheter itself. Then I will take my um, iodine and I will pour it on my cotton balls and discard. I will grab the penis with my non-dominant hand, retract the foreskin, and then I will clean three times with each cotton ball and then discard. Now the meatus is clean, I will discard. At this point, I will take my syringe with the lubricant and insert it into the tip of the penis, and I will discard. Then it is time to insert the catheter. While inserting the catheter, I'll have my patient take deep breaths, and I will insert all the way to the Y bifurcation. So I get to the Y bifurcation, I can hold the catheter with my non-dominant hand in place, and I will insert the water to make the balloon grow. And then I will discard my water syringe. I will then pull the catheter back till it is in place, and I will replace the foreskin. At this point, I am done with my catheter insertion. I can attach the catheter to, to the leg. And then I will hang my catheter bag to the side of the bed in a place where it won't be moved. I will clean up my supplies. I will discard my gloves. I'll cover my patient back up. Lower the patient's bed, assess their pain level, give them their call light, and then I'll perform hand hygiene, and then I'll document my procedure.